Yo, what's good, YouTube? This is Rob Dollar back with another fucking vid. Now, before I get into this vid, make sure you guys hit that thumbs up. Say, yo, dollars, we love what you're doing. Make sure if you guys are new to the channel that you subscribe. And uh, today, I'm late as fuck, but today I'm going to be doing my top 14 pickups of 2014. Now, hey, I'm starting off with the BHM ones. I like the shoe. It's dope. You know, I cop these for sure, like real comfortable. And um, this is number 14. You dig what I'm saying? I like them. You know, it's my 14 that I like. So these are definitely number 14. I wanted to pick them up. I mean, I wanted to make them higher in the countdown, but as you guys can see, these shits are starting to deteriorate. So I'm not really feeling them like that. But yeah, these are definitely number 14. You feel me? Comment down below. Let me know how you feel about these. Now let's go to number 13. Number 13. Gotta go with the great toe 13s. I'm feeling these. Classic shoe in my opinion. And uh yeah, man. Great toe 13. You dig what I'm saying? I wear these shits to walk them to the strip club. I mean, you know. Number 13, man. I see number 12. See what that is. Number 12. Black Toe 14s. And the reason why these made number 12, because they would have been low on my countdown, because I love OG classic colorways. The reason why they so high is because they so uncomfortable. I can't even front. But it's crazy, because as I go deeper into the countdown, y'all, I'm going to trip y'all out with. These are size 11. I'm going to trip y'all out with something with one of the other shoes I have. You know what I'm saying? But number 12, got to be Black Toe 14s. Big fan of these. OG colorway. Just real uncomfortable, you feel me? Let's go to number 11. Number 11. I had to go with the sport blue threes, I'm tripping. Fire in my opinion, simple three, you know what I'm saying? You know these shits is going in the vault of threes. So I had to put these at number 11, man. I'm a big fan of these. I, they, I, to me, I, I call them the black true blue threes. I fuck with them, you know what I'm saying? Comment down below, let me know how you feel about these. Let's go to number 10 and see what number 10 is. And number 10, I got to go with these, man. Pantone 11s. You guys know these shits was expensive as fuck. Two shoes. I wear my shits, you feel me? I, and these are number 10 because of the color, that baby blue shit, you feel me? But uh, yeah, number 10, Pantone 11s. Comment down below, let me know how you feel about these. Now we're heading towards the city digits, all right? Let's go to number nine, see what they are. Number nine, Spazike Sixes. You guys know when I first got these, even when I got them early, these shits was, to me, I was fucking with them hard, you feel me? But these made number nine, you dig what I'm saying? Comment down below, let me know how you feel about these. Spazike Sixes. Number nine, just simple red, upper, white mid, so, you know. So it made my number nine. I like these. You know what I'm saying? Enough to go number nine with these. You see, I got the motherfucker with the KDs on the right and the mellow ones on the left. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, number nine. And number eight on my countdown. Concord Lows. And the reason why these made number eight and wasn't like five through one is because they lows, you feel me? But these shits is fire, they Concords. I love the Concord colorway. You guys know how I feel about Concords. If you watch my videos, you know I always say these are like one of my favorite pair of Jordans is this colorway, the Concords. These shits meant so much to me. Back in the days when I was a young nigga, I had the high top ones or the mid tops, whatever. And these shit, man, we used to clean our shits with the motherfucking toothbrush and all that shit, make sure that white midsole was clean. But these came in number eight, all right, y'all? Let's see what number seven is. Legend Blue 11s, aka Columbia 11s. I'm feeling them. Simple, all white upper, patent leather. It's just that it's 11. You know what I'm saying? It's an 11. So, of course, you know I had to throw these in the countdown. You can rock these pretty much with anything. Kill it. You feel me? And niggas with banana dick for these. You feel me? But uh, yeah, 2014 top 14 pickups. You dig? Bubble gum. Ones, all black, OGs. And the reason why these made number seven is comfort, man. They not really that comfortable, you feel me? But they look hot on feet. I like the classic look of it. I, they, they were, man, they were real close to being my number one. But as soon as I wore them and I felt that pain, 
I was like, damn, they might, you know, these shit might have to be a little bit lower. OG, one highs, gun bottoms. The what, the LeBrons? There was so many people who talk about if you got them clown shoes, you gay, and blah, 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 and blah. I like them, so. And they would have been higher on the countdown, but it's the comfort, man. It's like, it's like with these shoes, I had good days where they felt good, and then days where they just felt like, oh, these shits hurt like a motherfucker, you dig? My top five shoes of 2014. Now it's getting down to the nitty gritty, my niggas. Let's see what it is. My number four pickup of 2014, gotta be the G the ones, man. Quality, material, everything is, everything is on point with these, man. Real dope shoe. Very, very rare, very limited shoe. It was very hard to get, but I did luck out and get them. So this is definitely my number four shoe. You dig what I'm saying? Now let's go to the top three of 2014. Take a guess of what it is. Let's see what number three is. <sighs> My number three shoe is boom, boom. Ferrari 14s, man. Real dope shoe, all right up. But now mind you, based on what I picked up this year, I had way more heat, but a lot of shit I sold, like that shit was out of here. You dig? Like I fuck with the slam dunk sixes. Nigga say, y'all give you that shit, all right, they gotta go. You dig what I'm saying? Put my number three, man, Ferraris. I love the red up with the materials, quality, and the way these shits fit on my feet. And it's crazy, because these are size 11, like my black toes, and these shits fit way more comfortable. No pain, no nothing, you dig what I'm saying? So yes, number three, Ferrari 14s. Now mind you, this is my top 14, all right? Let's see what number two and what number one is. And my number two, it gotta be the Yeezy Foams, man. These shits is fire. These shits is fire. Yeezy Foams, man, number two, glow in the dark bottom. Just fire, overall fire in my opinion, and that's why I picked these number two, like I said. Y'all niggas probably gonna be talking, man, shit like, why, cause he do this, pick this over that. Because it's my top 14 of 2014, you dig what I'm saying? Yeezy, Yeezy Foams is definitely number two. Now, the number one shoe of 2014. It gotta be. It gotta be. Ooh wee! My number one shoe of 2014. Black infrared sixes. This basically started the movement of Jays, man. I remember my little brother had these shits, and I was like, "What the fuck are those? We kids, you know what I'm saying?" I'm like, "Yo, what the fuck are those?" He like, "These Jordans, man. Like these are fucking Air Jordans, man." And these are shits that started me with the Jays, man. I think because back in the days, like they would drop Jays and shits to sit on the shelf. So I went to get these, but I accidentally mistake the uh, because I didn't have the sixes, but my brother had it. But, so this shit started an epidemic. Like niggas went bananas. Like we just started copping Jays, but this shit. I thought the fucking Raptor 7s were these. So I wound up my first pair of J's with the Raptor 7s. So you guys know I'm looking forward to 2015. You feel me? Because I'm going ham with the 7s. The first pair of J's I've ever had with a Raptor 7. So he had the 6s. I seen these shits. I like, yo, them shits is hot. I'm going to stake the Raptor 7s for these because I'm a kid. I was a kid back in the day. So I, I didn't know. So I went and got the motherfucking Raptor 7s. And I beat them shits to the ground, like the Raptor 7s. They, they, them shits got beat to the ground, but yeah, man. This year's number one pick for me, personally, are these infrared sixes. And that's due to the fact that this shit started the movement of J's. Like, niggas had to have J's after these shoes, you feel me? The sixes started everything. Comment down below, let me know how you feel about my top 14. I know the niggas gonna be like, yo, you had these. You picked those over these, over the Jeters, over these, over that. Yeah, I did, man, because this is this is what my number one shoe was, and it's because it meant this this is what started me copping J's. You feel me? So I'm definitely looking forward to 2015 because the year the sevens is coming. And I'm hoping that they had a Raptors, because that's what started. That was my first pair of J's, Raptor Sevens. You dig what I'm saying? But make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. I'm so sorry for the late vid, man. I forgot all about the top 14, but it's there, it's done. And this shit will be uploaded, and you give me your opinion on the shoes that I chose. Alright, y'all? This is Rod Dollar. I'm out.